And Sanjay, as more people get vaccinated, 200 million shots so far, what's your advice to those who are worried about potential symptoms from the vaccine? You and I both experienced some relatively minor symptoms uh, from when we got vaccinated. Should people take painkillers before they get vaccinated, after specific drinks to stay hydrated? What do you think? Yeah, I, I, um, I don't think you take the painkillers before. Two reasons. One is that you may not need them, so why take them? And if you're an older person, it may be actually risky to take some of these painkillers. So, but if you need them afterwards, you can take them. The second reason not to take it before is in part, you're giving the vaccine and basically inducing this inflammatory response. If you give anti-inflammatories ahead of time, you may blunt that response a bit. So, you know, again, if you're having significant symptoms, take them after plenty of fluids. And also, you know, sometimes people will get sort of this itchiness or a COVID arm, you may have heard, and it can look quite dramatic. Antihistamines can help with that. If you got COVID arm in one arm the first time, second time, you may want to ask to get the shot in the, in the other arm. So things like that. But uh, the symptoms are, are pretty self-resolving, Jake.